berthing, anchoring, and other mooring operations. Anchors and cables. An anchor is a hook attached to a length of a chain called cable. By which a ship can be held temporarily to the seabed in shallow water. Types of anchor. Stockless anchor of type standard stockless and AC-14 stockless is the most commonly used anchor on modern ships. The advantage of the stockless anchor is that it is easy to store and can be kept flush to the ship side. It does not hinder with the mooring operations of the ship when coming alongside to a berth. D shackle shank crown blade arms bill fluke one end of the cable is connected to the anchor shackle of the anchor. And the other end called the bitter end is connected to a strong point in the bulkhead of the chain locker. The chain passes through the gypsy of the windlass into the chain locker via the spurling pipe. The other end of the chain passes through the hose pipe to the anchor. The anchor chain is joined at intermediate lengths by a lugeless joining shackle. In between the anchor shackle and the first joining shackle, there is an intermediate link called half shackle. It is to disconnect the anchor from the chain and pass the chain to a mooring buoy. The kenter or lugeless shackles consisting of machined parts, studs, and pins have the appearance of enlarged studded links which are assembled and locked together by a pin. If lugeless shackles are used, then open links are not fitted at the ends of the lengths of cable. A stud is fitted in the link of anchor chain to prevent from kinking and it also adds to its strength. Marking of anchor cable. The length of the cables is marked in succession as follows. 1. At the first shackle by a piece of seizing wire on the stud of the first link on either side of the joining shackle. 2. At the second shackle by a piece of seizing wire on the second studded link on either side of the joining shackle and so on. Three. All the links up to the marked links are generally painted white so that they may be easily identified. 4. Each joining shackle is also painted in red. 5. The seizing wire and the paint marking should be kept in good condition so that the number of shackles can be identified easily when letting go the anchor. Each length of chain from shackle to shackle is 27.5 meter. Normally ships carry about 10 to 12 shackles of chain on each anchor.